Hello everybody, it's DaffyDuck91 here from Not A Gamer Gaming, and we are on day three, episode three of Seven Days to Die version 1.0. We hit up here last night. I kind of took a bunch of crap apart. I looted the downstairs, and in doing that, I may or may not have attracted quite a bit of zombie friends. So I don't know how I'm going to go about killing all these guys while I'm this encumbered. But, uh, well, there's a will. There's a way. Oh, God. I think we're going to have to, like, go down there. I'm so encumbered. Hold on. Let's, uh, let's just be, let's just be professional. Um, let's throw away this dollar bill. Let's make a storage crate. I'm just going to throw the stuff in the crate and then take on the zombies not encumbered. Man, guys, sometimes I shock myself with just how much epic gameplay I produce for you. All right, she daytime. They're slow now. We've humped. We've dumped. Let's go smack some bitches. Oh, man, you guys tore it up down here. I think they even, like, broke some of the furniture. Okay, maybe that's it. Only two? It sound... Oh, there's a gentleman out here. It sounded like so much more than just two, you know? I thought we had, like, a whole horde going on. Okay, I'm gonna go grab my stuff and then we're gonna take the uh, long walk back home. We're gonna dump, we're gonna hump, we're gonna go to Trader Wrecked. Not in that order. Well, scared the crap out of me, lady. Whew. I was just walking around all silent like, and then you just came out of the bushes. There we go. Oh, caused me a little anxiety. I was just enjoying the uh, blissful crickets chirping or birds chirping or whatever um sometimes i like usually when i play i keep a headphone out of my ear just so i can hear how loud i'm talking but today i was like meh let's put them both in and uh the immersion is quite different audio wise so maybe we will be a little bit more startled look at this like storm coming in it's like bending the trees. Cool. All right, wrecked. I don't know how to tell you this, buddy, but I'm like 91.2% wet. I'm gonna go inside and I'm about to just like dry up like a shriveled raisin. That's what's gonna happen. The second I see your pudgy belly and hear your lovely voice. State your business, fool. Yeah, you there we go. All now, dried you? up. Here's your pain, um, Einstein. Man, I don't know. First aid bandages? Sure. Are they going to drop on the floor? Um, I'm going to grab another job. That's another one that's super far away. The Malone like residence. Moving, okay. Just don't pay my um, I'm going to see if I can sell him some my stuff shop, too. My rules. Honestly, guys, I don't have a lot that I want to sell him. <laughs> There's just not a lot going on here. I don't have too much stuff. I might buy some blueberry pies. There we go. Have something to eat. But yeah, I mean, maybe you have ammo and stuff, but I don't know. I'm I'm not in the mood to look. Really, right now, I just want to bike. So I'm going to go home, drop a load, and then we're going to go quest. Like, quest as much as we can. It's day three. Horde's still quite a bit away. So yeah, we're just going to try to get ourselves a bicycle first. All right, home sweet home. Well, home sweet temporary home. Uh, we're definitely not going to be living here permanently, but it's going to do for now. Uh, let's drop our loads. Uh, do we have like anything we can cook? I did grab some meat off of a snake last night, but I don't think I can really cook it. Um, cook that. Cook some boiled eggs. Cook some charred meat. Do we have any water? You know, we can never have too much of that. There we go. Got some stuff cooking. Okay, we're cooking food. We stored some stuff. Let's check out where this quest is. Um, okay, so we look like we're going to go back past Bob Boards and Carl's Corn. That's fine. We'll go ahead that direction. If we see some POIs on the way, we'll stop. We'll take a peek of Rooney. You know, we're still kind of planning on doing this organically. I should check. Oh, yeah, I got one point. I'm still kind of a noobish at spending points, guys. And the frustrating part for me is that 
normally I will play a recording and then I'll edit it and post it, read the comments, get a lot of tips. But uh, I decided to batch record a few on streamer weekends since I wasn't streaming. So I've yet to read any of your wonderful advice. I probably won't read anything until day four. So this is all just raw Daffy gameplay with like a little bit of help from Jen. Because he has, I've been like, yo, what do I do on like day three? What do you normally do on day four? Um, and I love that I still have to ask that question because I don't think about this as like a gamer. Oh God, that was juicy. Oh yeah, you got one ball hanging out. Um, I don't ever play as like a gamer. I normally play with Jen, dirty, and follow his lead. So um, causing chaos, of course, and all laughter because we all know that I'm the funny one. But yeah, he normally, you know, tells us how to go about the gameplay and I just sort of follow along. But for this one, I'm all by myself. All right, it's a little foggy. Just a, a tad bit. We do have something up here. I'm not sure what it is, like a raider station. Oh, maybe a restaurant of some kind. It's got a flag. Does it have any, oh God, three scullies. Yeah, we're not. I might loot the car, I'm not going in there. We are not going to any place that has three scullies because that just is sus. That is super suspicious. That means there's a lot of McNasties in there. It doesn't even look that big. It doesn't look big enough to have a lot of McNasties. But definitely does. I'm not ready for three scullies. No way. Jose. Yeah, there's got to be more to this place. I mean, three scullies and it's this tiny? Yeah, there's got to be more. I'm curious. I'm sure we'll come back to it, but not today. Okay, so we're basically here. This looks like a little community. There's a bunch of little houses. I kind of want to like hang out here and loot a ton of them. Now, this being said... If we do that, we could run into, you know, quests that we're going to be missing out on because I do not double, double loot a POI. Oh my God, two scullies, no way. Um, I don't normally double loot them. Uh, basically, I'll only run one POI per session. So like, that's why I mark them with X's, right? So I know I've done all of these POIs. I don't want to do them again. Is that pro gameplay? Probably not, but I like the variety. I don't want to do the same things over and over, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so um, I try to stick to the POIs that don't have the scullies. Because I feel like a POI with a scully is one that will quest to. Let me know if I'm wrong. Like, we'll do this one. Deal. We'll do this, this place, the Malone residence. And then we'll do this, um, this non-scully one. I don't know what it's called. It just popped up here. But I feel like if it has a scully on it, then that means it's uh, a questable place. And if it doesn't, then you don't quest there anyway. So they're safer to do. But yeah, let me know if I'm wrong. I could be wrong. Okay, we're going in through the garage. I think I'm just going to wang and bang. Uh, it's a bit faster and I've got my points spent into it. So, I mean, let's let's combo sneak and wang and bang. See uh, where the day takes us. You know, we can kind of be ready to sneak and then whip out the bloody club. Quite literally, see it's so bloody if we need to. All right. You dirty whore. All right, Amber, I'll bring you down. Come on. I was hoping to do a little sneaking. But nope. Wouldn't give me that opportunity. Let's try this again. Okay. There's definitely... Somebody else up here. Let me get on my knees. I did end up spawning in a headlamp. Um, I was editing the last video and boy, was she dark. So apologies in advance. It's going to be hard to watch. But uh, yeah, we've got ourselves a little a little light here. Ah, you whore. Oh, got right up in your face. This is what I get. Oh, God. Okay, hold on. He wants a pounding. I just think I'm better at the game when I'm not sneaking. Jen is definitely the archer in this relationship. Oh, guys, I'm fatigued. 10% more damage. Eat a vitamin to cure this. I don't have a vitamin. I don't even know if I have a vitamin at home. I better just not get anything tickled while we're in here. All right, we got another level here. Um, I mean, Pummel Pete just seems like the way to go. Pack meal. Let's do another pack meal. I just don't like being encumbered. I still don't really know what I'm doing. I know I'm focusing on strength because I like to hit people with my bat. 
Uh, but obviously, we're probably going to have to diversify a little bit, especially since I'm using a pistol. But maybe I'll find a shotgun. I don't know. We'll wing it. All right, big scary basement. Big scary basement. Nothing good ever happens in basements. Let's turn off. Oh, it's just too dark. See if I can sneak shot anything, but look with the headlamp on. Oh yeah, baby. Oh God, this arrow glitch is just a part of this game at this point. All right, boys. Oh no, you're just gonna just sleep there? Okay, sounds good to me. Beautiful. Big daddy, on the other hand, you want a little bit of this. You woke up early. Beautiful. Are we done? Oh my God, we're done. Wonderful. Let's give this a quick loot. That was almost too easy. I'm such a pro. Hopefully we find a vitamin, something juicy, and then we'll head across the street and do that other place before going home. All right, got some food. Got a medical journal, get you a jig. Got some more ammo. Uh, fortifying grip mod, pipe bomb, slobber. That is nice. Let's see if I can put the mod right here. Oh baby, we are so encumbered right now. All right, so that's this entire place. Let's head out of here. Uh, then let's go make our way across the street. I will make a hump and dump, guys. We're going to need to, to, you know, deposit a load before we head into another POI. All right, we got our load deposit box. And we're going to just kind of shove everything in here before we jump into this other POI. All right, load has been deposited. We're going to head into the Lincoln residence. And, uh, see what the zombies have in store for us. Maybe some vitamins. Let's, let's all cross our fingers for our, some juicy vitamins. Okay, let's start with the, a very, very cramped garage. Like, oh my goodness, how do you even get around in here? All right, we've got improved shotgun crafting skills. Club crafting skills? What kind of club can we make now? Wooden club level three. Oh baby, we need to get some more wood for that. But yeah, this is a, this is a little bit of a cramped space with a SUV. It looks more like a van, but I mean, I guess it's an SUV. Um, squished in here. Oh yeah, let's make this club right now. Juicy, juicy, juicy. Is it just me or do these cabinets look halfway in maybe these are upper cabinets painted like lower cabinets i don't know hello i know you guys are in here come on come on out let's hang out i know you're here i know you want to play well oh there you go fall down the stairs sir booty bounce <laughs> oh god i'm i'm almost too confident I was playing a stream with the hubby on streamer weekend and I mean, I only played for a little bit cause I was just too exhausted to kind of do the whole thing with him. But, um, he had his zombies set to like warrior settings and the difference to me was kind of eye opening. Everything on this playthrough is all very vanilla, very standard. I just wanted to get kind of my feet wet with the game again. And yeah, the warrior ones definitely took a lot more of a pounding to kind of put out of their misery so I'm glad we're easing into it this way because I feel a little bit OP maybe a little bit too confident you know what I'm saying and there really wasn't much going on in this POI like we were already done that was a little sad you know what I mean didn't even get that much loot there was obviously nothing fun hello But yeah, nothing too exciting going on in here. Oh God, we're not gonna be able to take everything home with us. Uh, we're gonna have to go through and get rid of some stuff. All right, we got another POI right here that doesn't have a skull on it. Adds a small chance to mine rare gems. Okay, thank you. So maybe we'll put another box down. Um, I don't even have the room to like craft this thing. Throw another deposit box down in front of this place and go ahead and do it while we're here. We've got a lot of daylight and it's kind of a jaunt back to the trader. So we might as well, I don't know, loot as much as we can on the way. All right, this seems like another easy one. Oh, look at this, how cute. 
This little tree house. It's got a little bedroll in it. Aw, I love that. Yeah, that's kind of super cute. This is concerning. There's probably a dog in here, so at least we have a gun for that. We wasted six lock picks on this, guys. That is just damn depressing. Oh, boiled meat and yuck juice. I've been actually getting quite a bit of those, um, like, cooking books. So that, that's handy. It feels like I've been sailing right through with it. Give me some vitamins. Any kind of vitamin would make me a happy camper. Anything. Oh, oh yeah. Gave him great head. This place is a little rough. There's, like, moss coming out of the ceilings. She don't look too pretty. A locked closet? Oh, that's interesting. Nothing even juicy in there. I think that's it, unless there's an upstairs I'm not aware of. Doesn't seem to be, just a bunch of holes in the roof. Alright, let's bang out this uh, lovely safe on the wall that we wasted six- Oh shit. No way. Alright, let's move on. I was gonna say we wasted a lot of lock picks on it, but I'm not banging that out. All right, guys, it's getting late. I'm going to grab my stuff. Let's head back to Trader Wrecked and see what kind of reward we can get. Wrecked, I'm 45.5% wet again. It's been a very wet day for you and I. You'd almost think we were into each other. Um, I've been working super hard for you. And by that, I mean I did one quest and looted a bunch of BOIs around it. But hey, I was appreciative to have been sent in that direction. I have to talk to you while I'm outside because the second I get up to you, you have something nasty to say. Okay, fucker. You respect the shop rules, and we'll get along just fine. I'd shake your hand, but I bet you got dysentery the way you smell. Is it just me? I mean, after he did just say that, but, like, is he getting nicer to me as I do his quests? Wouldn't that be, like, an interesting kind of dynamic? I have no idea what of all of this I want. Grilled corn. Charred meat. Imp I might as well just grab that. I don't have any space for it. Let me throw this sham sandwich. All right, beautiful. Let's grab me. Oh my God, all the jobs are so far away. All Listen right, up, we'll grab that guys. one. You won't. Well, don't just Wonderful. stand there with your thumb up your ass. Go do the goddamn job. I take it back. I thought you were being nice, but uh, nope, I was wrong. Let's go home, guys. Let's unload and figure out where this quest is. Oh my gosh. I don't know how many quests I need to do. Four out of ten. I think I, I think I have to do all ten of them to get a bike, which is just cruel and unusual. All right, let's go home. Let's unload. And we might as well just walk in the general direction of that quest and kind of do what we did in the last episode where we make our way there um, and set up camp for the night. Okay, home sweet home. Let's drop a load as much as we can. Uh, and then we're going to head out again. Oh, my goodness. Our chests are going to be so full by the time we're done all this. What do we got going on in our campfire? Eggs, meat, water, potatoes, turn you off. Check our map. Goodness, we've got a bit of a jaunt. All right, let's head out again. You know, on the way, if we find something juicy, we'll uh, we'll take a look. We'll stop. Okay, here's a building, but U.S. fire post. It looks like it's a big one, like a high tier. Like, Daphne, don't go in here. Oh, yeah. Ranger station. Nope. Big, fat, nobody, nope. Let's keep going. Okay. I remember this POI. I've made this POI my base so many times in so many different alphas. I think we can go in here. I don't think you're a scully one. Oh, you are. Damn it. All right. I'll leave you alone. I want to wait and see if I get a quest there. We may never. Like, I don't know how long we're going to be in the area. And if we'll get quests that kind of go in these locations. But I, I want to just give it some time. Okay, I was beelining it. But then I realized, like, look, we're probably going to have to cross the river. Might as well take the fancy bridge, which I haven't seen before. So this is new to me. I think it's new to me. I mean, maybe there was a bridge here before. But I don't know if it was had all these, like, beams and stuff. Oh, it looks so pretty. Is that a chicken? Oh, I'd love to get me a chicken. I feel like I'd almost have better luck catching it on foot than shooting it. Here, chicken, 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 chicken. Pachop! Chop! Chop! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Ah! Ha <laughs> ha! Looks like it was running to its babies. Beautiful. Whoo! 
we made it. I didn't think we would get here in time. Is this the like Hopewell place? Looks familiar. Once Jen and I played um, like a PVP marital blitz, which I would love to do again, guys. I would love to get a lot of uh, of the oldies back now that the game is finalized. Um, and I lived here at Hopewell Cabin. That's where I lived and I like the walls that were around it. Um, damn it, should I start this right now? This is a bad idea. Oh, fuck it. Let's just go in. Let's just go in and kill them like this. Yeah, Jen and I did um, Marital Blitz, Domestic Falls. These are a lot of things we'd love to get back into. Even a multiplayer pal world we'd love to get back into. If we can, we've kind of decided looking at our life and at time and kids. Um, in order for us to really succeed with the multiplayer content, we'd have to have one of us not be working full time. So right now, both of us work full time uh, as well as take care of our four children. And Jen has his own content, of course. And then I'm trying to do this in the hopes that maybe we can get us to doing multiplayers again by being able to go full time. So that's the plan. If you guys would like to see multiplayer content, just make sure you support the stream and tell your friends, you know, all that jazz. We're fun. It's not the stream, but the, you know, the channels, his and mine. And then hopefully we can get some more multiplayer stuff over here on Nag. This is going to drive me nuts, lady. I just want you to die. Beautiful. Look. Quest complete, and technically, if I needed to, I could just stay up here. All right, we got like an hour. Let's go down here and see what kind of damage we can do. See if we can totally clear the place. Ah, and we got a skill point, and we cleared the place, and it's almost nighttime. I am 110% proud of us. Let's check out our end loot. Okay, so improves electrical traps, more electrical crafting, sounds good. Some blood, ammo, scavenger gloves. Okay, so this is new. Medium armor, protect those knuckles and concentrate on your salvaging efforts. Increase resources when salvaging. Full set bonus, find better quality loot. Fun. Okay, so I take it if I wear these, my ability to loot gets higher. All right, can I, uh, what does this thing do? Modifies the trigger group to fire full auto only. Increases the rate of fire and slightly, I don't know if I can put that on my pistol. Oh, I can. Oh, baby. Okay, I haven't even really shot my pistol yet. I've been trying to conserve it, but uh, I'm impressed. We did it. We completed the POI. Now we get to spend the night just looting the crap out of it until tomorrow. Oh god, guys, it's almost nighttime. Hold on. Let's get inside. I was looting. Getting distracted. I don't want to be on the floor here when the zombies come in. I haven't even beaten this stuff down yet. Okay, this is fine. Nobody panic. All right, guys, that's it for me. If you liked the video, give it a big fat like, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you in our next episode where we hopefully will still be alive because we're banging this out. All right, everybody. Bye.